All right, this is the insulating brick rocket stove. This is what comes in the kit. You have one, two, three, four, five, six long ones, and then one, two, three, four short ones. And I have a couple of grates. This top grate. It's going to be a shelf where you're going to put the fuel on. And you're going to have a roll of three pieces of high temperature duct tape. And if you ever need to get more of this, you can get it at a local hardware store. Right for assembly, we're going to start with the long bricks. Just lay one down, lay two on either side. I'm going to get some short ones. I'm going to put a short one up front. Put a short one on the back. I'm going to take the other two short ones and we're going to stack them across here. Let's stack the second one high. And we're going to stack back around the corner. It's probably isn't as straight as it could be doing it one hand. And also make sure you do it on a level level base, it'll help you. I think you're gonna take these strips of tape here. You're going to wrap one around the front, all the way around here, and you do two on the side, one across the face of that brick, and then one up here. For the grates, that's going to sit in there like that. And I've got one set up outside that we're going to go use. And the reason these are so great is because this is insulated fire brick. It's ten times more insulative than regular fire brick. So this is an inch and a quarter is equivalent to about 10 inches of regular fire brick as far as the insulating properties. And this is what you want for a rocket stove is for all the heat. They're going to load the wood in here. You want all the heat to come up through this flue. All right here we're going to light it. I've got some cardboard with some wood. If you're wondering where I got the wood from, it's actually from a pallet that I broke down. So we're going to go ahead and put the chimney back on. Settle there. And like the cardboard. All right, once that's lit, just put the back brick on. Okay, we've got our stove going. It's been about two, three minutes. I can tell you got black smoke coming out. That means it's burning too much fuel, not enough oxygen. So what you're going to do to adjust this is pull some of the wood back until that black goes away. Side box at 70 degrees. Side of the flues at 138. 140 side of the pot 7 so only goes to 1000 degrees so that's 911 and I've used my four original sticks and I just added a, another one here but you see the flames are still just shooting out so Back out the wood a little bit to, to adjust your flame. So that's how a rocket stove works. Very fuel efficient, especially with insulating fire bricks. Bottom of the pan, still 770, 8, 900 degrees. Side of the insulating fire brick, 176. Side over here on the left, about 204.